Now, one reason why we learn fiscal policy is so that we can use it in times of recession. First, it is important for us to understand what is the technical definition of a recession. The technical definition of a recession is two consecutive quarters in which there is a contraction in GDP. What is the macroeconomic picture during a recession? During a recession, as a result of falling incomes, consumers spend less. This causes firms to cut down on production. Since labor is a derived demand, firms also hire less workers. Thus, unemployment increases. An important reason why Keynes argued for government intervention during a recession is because of his sticky wage argument. According to classical economics, a recession is not really a problem, as wages will fall in line with the fall in the demand for labor. Any resulting e unemployment is simply termed equilibrium unemployment. However, in Keynes' view, wages are sticky downwards. That is, they tend to exhibit a reluctance to fall downwards. This is problematic from a macroeconomic point of view. Consider a labor market in which the initial wage is W0. If the demand for labor falls, but wages do not fall below W0, there will result in this equilibrium unemployment of Q1 minus Q3.